The Suffering Servant Jesus knows all about suffering. Isaiah 52, 13 through 53, 12 prophesied and described the suffering servant. And he came. The four Gospels, Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John, address the birth, life, purpose, message, miracles, death, resurrection, and ascension of Jesus Christ. The Messianic prophecies were fulfilled. Jesus suffered as the blood atonement for our sins. We serve a God who understands human suffering, the chief sufferer of all time. The God-man suffered for us. He was perfect and righteous, the Passover lamb without blemish. Jesus is the embodiment of all suffering. Our Savior suffered more than we will ever suffer. He bore the sins of the world. He became sin for us. He is our definition and example of suffering. He endured the cross for the supreme purpose of saving our souls. He is also the supreme definition of unconditional love, agape love. We should always keep Jesus in mind when we try to understand the mystery of suffering. We see the God-man suffer for a purpose. We see how he did it and why. Suffering is built into God's ultimate plan for us. He suffered to save us. We become more like him through our sufferings. The suffering servant gives us instructions on how to live a victorious life full of heartache, pain, sorrows, and suffering.